Finally tonight, students at Malacca Elementary School start fundraising in kindergarten for their sixth grade send-off trip. Today they arrived at their destination, Deep Portage Learning Center in Hackensack, where they'll learn about the environment through a hands-on experience. Mel Meyer has that in this week's Community Spotlight. The school has been coming to the center for nine years, spending five days in the great outdoors. They're going to have like 24 different classes this week, so they're going to be very busy. Each year, about 10,000 kids come through for rock climbing, hiking, a 50-foot high observation tower, walks through the bog, and other great activities. I know you have been waiting for this trip for a very, very long time. Science teacher Mike Rademacher says this helps get students interested in outdoor activities. As the kids say, I can't believe that was a whole week. I didn't miss my TV. I didn't miss my phone. I didn't miss my video games. Reading teacher Jody Udston says after just one visit, you'll be hooked. Helps them grow in so many ways, more than just academics. I mean, the academics are there, but the team building and... Um, it just seems really worthwhile to me. Through school visits, summer camps for kids, adults and families, and other group activities, the center continues its mission to promote a more environmentally literate citizenry. They hope to serve many, reaching 100 schools from all over the state. The whole point is for it to be an accessible place for young people to come and learn. Along the way, inspiring many. I looked back at, um, well, high school yearbooks for graduating seniors. Like, what was your favorite memory? They're like sixth grade deep portage trip. When the students are finished unpacking, they'll be going to do outdoor activities and learning about area bats. For this week's Community Spotlight in Hackensack, I'm Mal Meyer, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.